240Z Dotson. Of course, so many of these Dotsons having been brought back to life. It's one of the hot cars in the affordable end of the collector car market these days. We had an opportunity recently to visit with one of the top shops around the country, bringing these Zs and Dotsons back to life. Hi, I'm Scott Joy, and I love 240Zs, which is why I was so excited to hear that Nissan was the honor mark this year. 50 years later, Dotson is still thriving, and there's no better example of that than Z Car Garage. Let's go have a look. So you're part of a special collection of garages who work on these cars. Absolutely. I'm honored to be a part of the Z Car Garage, and, you know, um, from going to where I was at as a Datsun 510 guy that wanted all of my friends to have Datsun 510s to a 240Z guy where I wanted all my friends to have them to get to do it and take care of people's other Datsuns and help them kind of discover what I discovered. It's awesome. Cool. So let's get it onto the dyno as quick as we can and let's rock this mother out. Well, I always loved cars, but then I, I was messing around with this little 1978 Honda Civic CVCC and I read an article in Sport Compact Car, said Datsun 510, Colt Car of the 90s. And I read that article and I was like, whoa. And I just searched out for a 510 and then discovered the world of Datsuns and I've been, my name's Rob Fuller and I'm addicted to Datsuns. <laughs> so 20 plus years of that. That 510 that Rob bought 24 years ago, this is it. And he still drives it almost every day. Well, there are so many recognizable examples of the Datsun and Nissan brand here this weekend, but don't think for a minute that the company is just looking backwards. They are gazing into the future. With more on that, here's Justin Bell. Now, one of my favorite things about this weekend on the Monterey Bay Peninsula is how it brings together all generations of car enthusiasts.